Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I am here with Geeky Sparkles. Hello. And we're going to talk about uh, Twitch. And we're going to talk about boobs. Uh, because, <laughs> because apparently, apparently Twitch is allowing uh, tasteful nudes. What does that even mean? It's artistic nudity. <laughs> on, their, on their platform. So basically Twitch is turning into OnlyFans. This is how desperate they are. I, I did a video on the other channel, uh, the gaming channel, uh, talking about how Twitch shut down in South Korea because they said it's just it's too expensive. And that was the, the biggest uh, video game streaming service or platform in South Korea. And they're like, yeah, we can't even afford our, our servers. So they shut down. They've been uh, laying people off like crazy. And uh, now, uh, now they're going to allow boobs on Twitch, uh, among have, other parts. They, they, is it, didn't they have a fit not that long ago that they were allowed, that they were banning people for doing that? Yeah, but now, now money. as long as it's tasteful. I don't even know what that means. I, money. I, we're going to talk. It means money for them. That's basically it. So I'm like, this is an Amazon company. This is Amazon. And they're totally cool with having basically an OnlyFans competitor. But you get banned if you have the word sheets in your name. If you have the word sheets in your name or you're the wrong kind of person or you accidentally swear or accidentally use a, what they consider to be a derogatory term on the platform, you get banned. So they're desperate because- But if you show your tits, you're good. If you show your tits, you're good, yeah. So we'll uh, we'll talk about this. Before we get into it any further, please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. Get a woohoo. 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 She is not showing you nothing because she's not. married, so that's not going to happen. <laughs> uh, hey, we're going to show you something. I got to change this. So we are uh, pretty far ahead in the Second Chance offers on the Clownfish Comics 2023 campaign. And if you guys want to order those books, that would be Crimson Wren and previously on Clownfish TV, I reopened that for you on shopclownfish.com. These books are actually in stock. I got to change this. This. Uh, language here. Uh, Geeky's been packing away for the last uh, month My or two. My hands are sore. Her hands are very sore. But um, we will reopen this for another month if you guys want to grab a copy of these books while we well, have Well, I know them. we don't have a whole lot of uh, previous and Clownfish TV. Like, I don't know, like 300 or so. Yeah. But yeah. They, we, we have Crimson Run, but the other one is not a whole lot. Just yeah. letting you know. Yeah. So if you want to grab them, grab them while you can. Grab them while they're hot. Uh, so then we'll go back to talking about boobs, right? Speaking of grabbing things while they're hot. <laughs> Speaking of grabbing things while they're hot. So they had to clarify this because apparently they they uh, came out with this uh, statement that they were going to allow sexual content on the platform. But that just means like not, you're not allowed to have sex on the platform. No, but you can show all kinds of bits. Okay. Yeah. So according to uh, Deserto, they put this up. Uh, Twitch updates sexual content guidelines amid topless meta backlash. Um, over the weekend, a new meta gained popularity on Twitch after streamer, cosplayer, and OnlyFans model Morgpie Pie went viral. Uh, the stream showed the broadcaster seemingly topless, sparking outrage across the net as to what kind of content was allowed on Twitch. Uh, she got banned, but now Twitch has officially switched up its guidelines in relations to that kind of content on the platform. So she got banned for showing her boobs, and then they're like, you know what? You know what? We need money. Let's show boobs. Let's, let's show let's, all the boobs. Let's use women to make money. We're just going to use what I mean, they might as well. Look, they might as well. Twitch stopped being a streaming platform for gamers years ago. Okay? It is basically e-girl central at this point, and then weird political people. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So they're including butt and pelvic region as yes. like allowable content? Yes, in a large post. Oh, okay. Boobs I can see, but like, Wow. In a large post, which I have that post, um, Twitch clarified a few major changes for the update, one of which now allows content that deliberately highlights breasts, butts, or pelvis, even when fully clothed, provided it's properly labeled. So you can show all the boobs, butt, and vag you want, I think, as long as you label it hey, correctly. Or penis. You can. I'm assuming if they're saying pelvic region, that should apply both ways. Yes. Uh, and if you got a little bit of both, why not? Why not? Uh, this aligns with one of the three reasons Twitch gave Morgue Pie for her ban earlier this week, uh, leaving viewers assuming that topless streams might be allowed moving forward. Uh, yeah. So we've gotten feedback on our policy. So Twitch also admitted that its previous outlook on this content was out of line with industry standards uh -huh. and resulted in female presenting streamers being disproportionately penalized. Wait, wait, so wait. 
a woman. You, you, you're being penalized because you can't show your tits. I'm like, or you could just have talent and be able to do games and stuff like that without showing your tits. I mean, there's that too. I just, you're female presenting streamers are being disproportionately penalized. Well, the men, male, male presenting are going to be too unless they're flashing their dick. Well, they, they say, okay. So here. I'm like, I mean, otherwise I, that, that's stupid. Basically, you have to use your boobs to get attention. Other policies that were once prohibited are now allowed with a label including fictionalized, fully exposed female presenting breasts or genitals. What's fictionalized mean? I don't know. Or buttocks regardless of gender. Body writing on female presenting breasts or buttocks regardless of gender. And erotic dances that involve disrobing or disrobing gestures such as strip teases. I'm sure parents are going to love their kids looking for Fortnite content, finding... Yeah, strip, strip, oh, I'm sure there's a lot strippers. of kids that would love to find this content. Oh my god! Remember well, you, you have to kids? label it, so maybe it's gonna be like like scrambling the HBO. I was gonna say, remember when we were kids and they just watch the scramble channels to see if you could see like anything. I used to listen to Scrambled Playboy, and you try to guess what was going on. You hear like moaning and music, but you didn't know what was going on. And I was a kid, so I didn't fully understand what was going on. I was just like, man, it sounds like they're either in pain or they're eating something really good well it could be <laughs> i'm just i, mean, I don't, don't know. know there's something fun going on here i don't know oh what's my. going on but this is the only channel on our we had one of those boxes you're not supposed to have because my uncle used to work with a guy who worked for the cable company mm -hmm. so we had one of those descramblers but that was the only channel that was scrambled so i got to watch hbo i got to watch showtime uh cinemax if you'd watch cinemax after midnight they had some good stuff on but uh yeah mostly i just i i would listen to playboy at like nine or 10 years old and try to figure it out. So that's what I'm saying. Of course, these kids are going to find these things. Absolutely. Label it or otherwise. So that's not all. That's not all. But wait, there's more. Certain dances, such as twerking, grinding, and pole dancing, are now allowed to stream on Twitch without a label. Are not allowed. Are, yeah, now allowed. <gasps> to stream without a so label. Your kid could be searching through and find somebody, some girl's ass in your face. <laughs> I'm like, I was looking for Ninja. I was looking for Ninja, Mom. Uh, and broadcasts that are labeled with drugs, intoxication, or excessive tobacco use, violent and graphic depictions, gambling or sexual themes will no longer be allowed on Twitch's homepage. Okay. So you can't use drugs or whatever, but you can pole dance. You There's can't no put label. the name sheet in your name, but you can, you can, you know, shit on camera. <laughs> this marks a major shift for Twitch's policies on such content. While responses currently appear to be mixed, many viewers are happy about the changes coming. I'm sure they are. Uh, this is their original post. Streamlined sexual content policy. Um, wow. Content recommendations for the homepage. So basically, yeah, they won't put this kind of stuff on the homepage, but you can still have as long as it's tagged. Share your feedback. Oh, uh, what's changing? Previously prohibited, but now allowed with label. Yeah. Deliberately highlighted breasts, buttocks, or pelvic region, even, even when closed. They don't have to be clothed. But I'm just saying, even when they were clothed, though, so what? If they were clothed, what's the, you know, but now you don't have to be clothed, which is. <sighs> My God. Um, yeah. So basically you can just, you can just go to town on, on Wait, Twitch. what was the thing about sexually su suggestive content? Sexually suggestive content. Content. Okay, wait. So in addition, the former sexually su suggestive content policy was, okay, out of, the, out of line. Yeah, uh-huh. Because women, you know, female presenting streamers, you know, are disproportionately penalized if you take the sexual suggestive content policy out. I'm like, I, yep. I have no words, you know. So no one would watch a woman unless she was showing her tits, I guess. It's I, like I, she can't she can't just play games. She can't be a good gamer. She's got to show her tits, too. That's how, you know, buy my $28 cookies. Well, that's what's going to happen, though. When these girls are playing and they're not the, those kind of girls, they're going to be like, well, you should be showing your tits. You should be bouncing and stuff like that. And they're going to get, like, harassed, probably. It's probably to cause more trouble for women who aren't doing that. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Uh, games featuring nudity, pornography, or sex, or sexual violence is... Are entirely prohibited so you can't like you can't have sex on camera you can't yeah you can't play like you know rape simulator 2000 or something it's probably some garbage game on steam well, that's know. games but can you have sex with your person playing the game can you play a game and have sex at the same time i don't know i mean is that allowed because it's not in the game you know okay users may not engage in simulated so wait a second wait a second wait a second you can show you can be topless you can twerk 
but you can't engage in simulated sexing and or erotic role play in online games. So you, does it, does it, that doesn't make any sense. We're talking fictionalized, but you can't do that. But you can show your boobs. Apparently. This doesn't make any sense. I mean, look, if someone wants to go on there and show their tits, more power to them. I'm, I'm just saying as a parent, I think you need to make sure that the kids yeah, aren't stumbling upon it, this. Yeah. I mean, labeling it or not. If you, kids aren't going to care if there's a label. They're going to go and open it anyway. You're going to need something, some way to make sure that there are locks in place so that kids aren't opening it up and being like, hey, what's this? <laughs> what's inside the box? Mama, yeah, I know. I that's, 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 show me your box. Anyway, people just on posts that are not even related to, oh man, they're not even showing the comments now. Yeah. I think they're deleting some of the comments. Yeah. People are like, what the hell is going on with Twitch? Um, they doubled anime slots. Which slots are we referring to? <laughs> they're desperate. This is why they're doing it. They are, uh, they're absolutely desperate for money. Did they take the comments down? I think they did. No, if yeah. you kept going down, you can usually see the rest of the comments. Let's see. I'm looking. I, I can't see much of it. Oh, here we go. You only want to celebrate certain streamers. Uh, Y'all literally made your platform a cam site. Yeah, pretty much. You're now a porn site. Me and Twitch will be selling partner accounts. <laughs> like it by, oh geez. Yeah, pretty much it. People are just like, you're, you're just, you're a garbage cam site. Now. Hardly, actually, it's a, there's not that many comments on it. There's not many no. likes. There's re, you know, it, it really, for it being Twitch, it doesn't seem to have a lot of interaction about it. All things considered. That has been goal since W. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, content recommendations on the homepage. Basically, if you want to put that stuff on there, fine, but we're not going to recommend it on the homepage. Um, yeah, so how are you going to enforce your rules your equally? Browsers get video game streams in here. Sorry. <laughs> Go ahead, back what you're saying. This is perfect. Yes. This is freaking perfect. That yeah. Wins. Like Twitch started as a game streaming site, and this is this is where we're at, guys. Uh, these are the people that get preferential treatment on Twitch now. You know, um, cost me three. It cost me three bands for drawing anime characters in swimsuits. In swimsuits. And even fully clothed back then, I was doing art only streams. I'm happy for these changes. Yeah, well, that's it. I mean, their their rules are uneven. Now, at least I will give them props for that. At least they're trying to. Say here clearly. Here are the rules, guys. You well, can so do the, this, that, and whatever. The next one that down here is: I feel if you want to allow it, it needs to be behind a specific category. I agree. Clearly indicating what type of content. Otherwise, don't allow it. Draw a hard line. Some of these streamers are literally using Twitch as an advertising for their OnlyFans, and I think that's. I, I'm more about protecting like for kids and stuff. You know, you really need to have that behind yeah. something that kids can't just get through. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my God. Yeah. There's a huge difference between body painting for the art and someone straight up being nude to get kids yes. into their content, which needs to be investigated. But well, at this point, I don't know about that. It's like, <laughs> you know, oh my God. See, that's what's going to happen. This is going to happen. Oh my God. Uh, yeah. Here's a pic of my cat. Do I want to know? I'm afraid. I can't wait to let my nuts hang loose and call it content. <laughs> He's a beautiful cat. Why don't they just make it not safe for work? That's exactly. But look at that pretty kitty. Oh, the kitty wants belly rubs. That pussy love, needs shaved. I love kitties. Oh, it's a pretty kitty. It's it a is. pretty kitty. Please make a saying for viewers to choose not to see 18 plus content label recommendations or not. Uh, clean up the home page is huge. I think that that actually is good. But like, obviously, read the titty. Obviously, um, you know there are some. Yeah, the pro the policies weren't unclear. The problem is your failure to enforce them. Yeah, I don't know, guys. It's it's basically Twitch is becoming this. This is basically it. But you know, they gotta make money, right? And that's where the money is right now. <laughs> I don't know what to I'm say. Just like, I, I just feel bad say. for girls that are actually on there playing games and they actually were on there. You know, that's what they were doing because now you gotta have these this whole influx of people who weren't watching Twitch before, coming in thinking it's OnlyFans light, and they're going to come in and be like, show me your tits, show me your tits, here's five, show me your tits. You yeah. know, and that's what's going to happen. So you're going to have girls that, like, that, that don't want to do that, don't feel comfortable. If you feel comfortable doing that, you know, hey, more power to you, I guess. Um, but what's going to happen is girls that don't want to do that are going to be harassed. Yeah. Um, wow, I don't know. 
I, this is yeah it's just like I, I don't even i don't even use twitch we don't even use twitch anymore it's not for gamers anymore it was and now it's basically uh talking heads and tits that's that's what it is so if that's your thing if you want to do that fantastic i don't want to do that you better not want to do that they're geeky me yeah. oh no no one wants to see that trust me i do no one else wants to see that trust me don't you tempt them no, they don't really. They really, truly don't. They think they do, but they truly do not. Okay. Anyway. I think we're going to wrap this up. Yes. Yeah, we're going to wrap this up. I, I'm afraid of the comments. Uh, please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. We'll talk later. Bye.